Hello. Um, so, I haven't really posted a lot of video blogs in a while, but the other day I tried to, um, and yeah, it was a little bit controversial. Oh, I mean, like, I've seen people post some controversial stuff in the past, and they're usually fine with it, right? It's so difficult to post anything about it, like, even if you post something on Facebook or, like, someone else's video, right? Like, I posted a video of Kate Shemarani on uh, one of my pages on Facebook, and that was actually part of my video I had in, in my video because I, I thought what she had to say was very important and kind of emotional and kind of really gets to you if you hear it. And, you know, there's an emotion in her voice, so y you kind of get the sense that, like, seems kind of like she really cares about this, you know? Like, I mean, like, I, you could always go, oh, but she's lying, you know? Do they think, like, these people are actors or something? You can feel the emotion when you hear her voice start to break. But, you know, I mean, I was also, I guess, swore a couple times in the video. I don't know if that's not okay anymore, because last time I posted a video blog, YouTube wasn't, like, Nazi Germany like it is now, I guess. <laughs> you know, like, I did, I did rant about stuff on there, and I swore. I'm pretty sure I, like, swore a couple times, you know, anywhere from, like, the S word to, like, the F word. And it was fine. Like, I've never gotten any, like, strikes or anything. There isn't any copyright issues, because it was just me talking, right? Well, I guess part of it was a copyright appeal, which I, I usually get problems with, because I, I do fan trailers, so, you know, everybody wants to claim their content. Give me money, 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 money. You know, like, you don't have enough money, you know? But yet, they need to take down someone's video, because, oh no, it's copyrighted content. They, they could solve world hunger if they wanted to. But no, they have to go and take down videos from the little guy like me, um, you know, because, I don't know. Well, I mean, like, they don't usually get taken down, but I get copyright strikes, and then they say, oh, they're, they're going to monetize and take the money for the ads being run on your video, and you don't have a choice. It's going to have to have ads, and they're going to make the money off of it, not you. Actually, um, I've never been able to make money off my videos, to be honest. Like, YouTube has never let me monetize. Like, at first, I just didn't really care. I just wanted to get my name out there and, like, make videos that people enjoyed, that I enjoyed, because I was always thinking, like, like, I loved watching fan trailers and music videos and stuff, and I said, I want, like, I wish there was a music video, like, specifically like this, or a trailer that was specifically, like, used these clips and those clips, and then I said, what the hell, I'm going to start doing it myself, you know? So I did, I started doing it. And at first I didn't care about the monetization, but then I started realizing, like, other YouTubers are making, like, a living off YouTube. So I tried to make a Google AdSense account, and I tried to, like, I, I linked it and everything, and it was like, sorry, you cannot make money off your videos. You cannot monetize. And, you, and there was a couple of videos on there that were completely non-copyright. For example, uh, one that got me a lot of views, I guess. The first real video blog I ever made was the re-emo scene kids suck thing. I was responding to someone who was hating on emo kids, I guess. And um, that got me a lot of views. And there was zero copyright issues on that. And like, if I was able to monetize that, I would probably be able to make a, a bit of money. You know? But no never able to do that because, you know, the little guy like me has to be, you know, stepped on by big corporations like YouTube and, you know, Warner Brothers and uh, whatever company makes anime. I've tried making AMVs before and not, never, not ever. I've seen them. I've seen them online. I, like, that's why I made, I, start, I tried making some. The fact that I was able to see those tells me that, like, YouTube didn't give a crap about that. They weren't like, oh, hey, by the way, um, your video is being taken down because of copyright content. It's like, no, they're allowed to do it, but then when I tried to do it, it was like, nope, your video has been blocked, removed worldwide. You can't, nope, you can't, you can't post it, sorry. No, that just, it's, it, I've just had so much struggle with YouTube over the years. At the heart of it all, like, I don't know why YouTube is being so Nazi about this. It's kind of sad, to be honest, because this is supposed to be a platform for people like the average Joe, like you and me, content creators to make, to put content out for people, like, or like Rebel News, I guess. That's what's so good about YouTube, in my opinion, is that you can just watch stuff that you would normally find, because like, I can put the TV on and be like, oh, I want to watch a news channel that focuses on, you know, the underdog, and like, on, like, stuff you wouldn't consider to be, like, mainstream, because, like, I don't like mainstream stuff, I really don't. Like, I don't watch the news, because it's just, it's depressing. It's depressing nowadays, you know? It is sad, and like, you know, I did just make a video about people dying. And it wasn't from the pandemic, it was from the lockdowns, because, truthfully, I've heard more about people dying from 
the lockdowns and the suicides that have been happening because of it. Mental exhaustion and the, just, like the depression, just the mental strain that it's put on people. Most of the deaths I've heard about have been suicides or not being able to see family, you know? And that's that's what really my heart goes out to because like I, I can't trust those stats. I really can't because they keep changing and like I'm it confuses me. I, I've just been through a lot of stuff. Like I've stopped my friend from I've like in the States I like found the number for the emergency number for that state specifically and got them to come to her house because she told me she overdosed. So yeah, it, it does hit kinda close to me. Most of what I'm hearing is like people are dying from suicide. You can't have an opinion about it, you know, you can't stray from the narrative, you know, because the narrative is like, oh, it's a pandemic. We must be scared. We must, you know, remain in fear and follow the rules and everything. In fact, um, isolation is actually a form of torture, you know, and that's why the lockdowns are so hard for people because, like, there, a lot of people, like, depends on your situation, you know, if you live alone, you, without any pets or anything, you don't live with family, you're screwed. You have to be alone during this whole lockdown because, you know, like, what are you going to do? You know, you can't do really much. And, you know, um, even if you live with your family, you probably drive each other crazy. There's a lot of domestic violence that's happened. There are ways around it, I guess. But it's not easy. A lot of people turn to drinking or, you know, excessively and, like, pot and stuff. Like, I mean, like, it's, I'm sure it's, it's, probably fine if you want to have a drink or two, but, you know, like, a lot of people have just turned to, like, excessive drinking. It's not great, and, you know, I'm not very happy that YouTube took my video down, because I spent a good amount of time trying to edit it and stuff, and making it, and, um, I don't know, they, they just don't care about, you know, content creators and their stuff, or, you know, like, the effort they put into it. I'm not getting paid. <laughs> All I want to do is just post my video online for free. You know, like, no one's paying me. Um, you know, I'm not getting monetization on my videos. It's, it's sad that, you know, content creators sit there with an idea in their head. And I've had this idea in my head for, like, months now. I mean, part of that idea was the music video I just posted. I was going to put it all together, but I was like, no, no, that would be way too long. But God bless, and uh, be safe. Use common sense, you know? And um, just question, question everything, I guess. Because not every big corporation out there has your best interests at heart. Trust me, I've experienced it with YouTube and, you know, monetization. Those are, those are other companies that are going in and being like, monetized, getting monetization off my videos, you know. And, you know, some of those get a lot of views, but, like, I've never seen a penny of that, you know. Just because it was, like, a short clip of, like, this or that. But, you know, I mean, there there's other people out there that you know, like, massive fan trailer YouTubers, and I don't know if they get monetized, I mean, like, I feel like maybe they do, or maybe they do some kind of other crowdfunding, but I don't know, algorithms hate me, I swear. Anyways, this is getting a little long, so God bless, and love you all, stay safe.